Hey guys, today's video is going to be on my current skincare routine. Let's get started. The first product is a brand new product at the drugstore. This is the Burt's Bee Micellar Cleansing Towelettes. If I happen to be wearing makeup that day, this is the first thing I use to remove my makeup. So this is a 3-in-1 product. It removes makeup, cleanses, and hydrates. It's for all skin types. And this has 30 pre-moisten towelettes in it. So this does a really nice job of removing foundation, eyeshadow, and any kind of powder product. It pretty much gets rid of most of the makeup. Next is a brand new product at the drugstore. This is the Garnier Skin Active Deep Pore Facial Cleanser. It is made with green tea and made without parabens, dyes, silicone, and sulfates. And this is a vegan formula. So this is a really nice product to use. It is a water-based product, but it's also gel-based. So this is a little bit more liquidy than your typical gel-based cleanser. This does a nice job of removing any excess makeup on my skin. It leaves my skin feeling really clean. It doesn't strip my skin and it just does a really nice job of removing dirt and oil. The next product is also a brand new product at the drugstore. This is the Garnier Skin Active Deep Pore Exfoliating Scrub. This is very similar to the cleanser. It's a little bit thicker of a gel product and it does have exfoliating beads in it. The exfoliating beads are far between. There's not too many and it's not too harsh. This does do a nice job of removing dead skin cells from the skin. So it's definitely something I really enjoy using at least once a week to remove any dead skin cells and it makes my skin feel soft and smooth as well. The next product is another new product at the drugstore. This is the number 7 Instant Result Purifying Heating Mask. It says deep pore cleansing for invigorated and healthy looking skin. This is suitable for sensitive skin. This does have very tiny exfoliating beads in it. If you wanted to skip over exfoliating that day, I think you could. So basically all I do is rub a little bit of this into my skin prior to allowing it to set for two minutes. That's the recommended time. And you definitely do feel the heat in this. It cleanses the skin really nicely. My skin definitely looks a lot smoother and cleaner when I use this product. It's really easy to use. It's something you can do a few times a week and it gives really nice results. After cleansing my skin, the next thing I use is the Dickinson's Original Witch Hazel Pore Perfecting Toner. This is an old favorite of mine. I've been using it for years. It does a really nice job of cleaning up the skin. It takes off any excess makeup that may be on the skin, any excess dirt. It's not too harsh for the skin and it works really great for acne prone skin as well. Next is another new product at the drugstore. This is the number 7 Early Defense Glow Activating Serum. It says glowing healthier looking skin in one week. This is also suitable for sensitive skin. So basically all I do is use about a dime size and I rub it all over my skin right after I apply the toner. This gives my skin a really nice glow. I definitely see a big difference in my skin over time. It's not too heavy of a product. You don't need too much formula. It's really easy to apply. You definitely have to give it a few minutes to absorb into the skin before you moisturize. The last two steps in my skincare routine are these two products. First is the Garnier Skin Active Balancing 3-in-1 Moisturizer. I've really been liking this moisturizer. It's a little bit thicker of a formula. It's really great for this time of the year. My skin has been getting dry from the winter weather and using something that's a little bit heavier is really nice to help moisturize the skin. And then the last product is the German E Skin Lighten Cream. This is my current dark spot corrector. I've really been loving this product. Basically all I do is spot treat any dark spots that I have on my skin. This works really well. It takes about two weeks to see the spots start to fade, but it's definitely been a favorite of mine for quite some time now. So here is an overview of everything that is in my skincare routine right now. A majority of these products are new at the drugstore. So if you're interested, I will have a link down below in the description box to all of the products. That is it for this video. Thank you for watching. I will see you next time. Bye.